Hello, boys and girls. I'm Mrs. Sue from the Ford's Library. And look who else I brought with me today. Our friend Timmy the turtle. And we all know what Timmy likes to play. Peekaboo! We've missed you. Welcome to story time. So we're going to start today with our hello song. Here we go. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. It's fun to be with you. And we all know it's story time at Ford. Sometimes we do a little bit of sign language. So we're going to start off with the sign for I love you. And this is how we do it. Do it with me. Point to yourself. I love you. Okay, let's try that again. I love you. And we all know when we come to the library, we're all book lovers. So this is how we say book. We just put our hands like a little book. And then we say, I love books. Hi, boys and girls. Today we're going to share some stories, and Mrs. Sue chose the theme to be ice cream today. So let's share our first story about ice cream. This is called The Ice Cream King by Steve Mettensger. And we always look at the beautiful end papers. Look at those sprinkles. The Ice Cream King. On a hot day in July, little Teddy Jones saw something that stopped him in his tracks. <gasps> Look, Mom, he exclaimed. It's a brand new ice cream shop. Can we go in? Can we please? Sure, said Teddy's mom. Inside, Teddy looked at all the flavors on the big board. Can I have anything I want, he asked. Just for me? Yes, said Teddy's mom, anything you want, just for you. As Teddy tried to decide, the server put a paper crown on his head. And, wow, that is awesome, Teddy thought. My mom said anything. Upon my throne of ice cream cones, I am the ice cream king. Ice cream treats are all I see, and they're all for me. Inside my ice cream castle, I slide down chocolate halls. I pick out rainbow sprinkles from mint chip ice cream walls. I slip and slide down whipped cream lane, then climb up ice cream mountain. I splash and dance and spin around beneath my ice cream fountain. I blast off in my spaceship up to ice cream moon. I zoom past ice cream meteors. I'm glad I have my spoon. Aboard my silver sailboat, I sail an ice cream sea. I fish for nuts and cherries. They're all for me, me, me. My very own volcano shoots up at Vanilla Fudge. Today's the ice cream festival, and I'm the only judge. I think there's something missing as I look around my throne. And suddenly I notice. That I am all alone. I dance and slide on ice cream. I can even wear it. But it would be much better with someone to share it. Little Teddy took off his crown. 
So have you decided, asked Teddy's mom. Yes, he said. Please give me a banana split with strawberry and chocolate ice cream and lots of lots of hot fudge and whipped cream and sprinkles and, 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 asked Teddy's mom, and asked the server, and Teddy said. Two spoons, right, right, to share it. Thank you, boys and girls. The end. Hi, boys and girls. Let's share some pretend ice cream today. So we're going to build our ice cream cone. And here is some ice cream. Oh, look at this one. It's the best in town. We have so many flavors. But the first one is chocolate brown. The second flavor is the creamiest ever. Let's scoop up that ice cream. Oh my goodness, look at this one. It's minty green. The third scoop, oh, this is so yummy. The best some might say, might think. Let's eat up a scoop. Oh, look at that. What color is that? Strawberry pink. Mmm, mmm. The fourth flavor isn't nearly so mellow. It's tart and sweet. It's called lemon yellow. The popular flavor is the fifth. What a sight! There at the top is vanilla. And what color is that? Oh, our ice cream cone is incomplete. Before we can be fed, let's top it off with a cherry. Mmm. And what color is that? Red. Thank you. Hi, boys and girls. So today we're going to learn another sign, and that's for ice cream. So the sign for ice cream is to put your hand like you're holding an ice cream cone and pretend you're licking it. Okay, so let's all say, I love ice cream. So our next story today about is about ice cream, and this is about a dog named Joe, not just Joe, but Groovy Joe, who loves not only ice creams, but also dinosaurs. And it's by Eric Litwin. Groovy Joe ice cream and dinosaurs. Groovy Joe saw something yummy. Groovy Joe started rubbing his tummy. Groovy Joe was living the dream. He had a spoon and a tub of ice cream and he started to sing. Love my doggy ice cream. Love my doggy ice cream. Arr! Oh no. A little dinosaur stomped into the room. He glared at that ice cream and took out a spoon. He put on a bib. He pulled up a chair. What did Joe say? It is awesome to share. And everyone sang. Sing with me. Love my doggy ice cream. Love my doggy ice cream. Arr! Let me hear you boys 
boys and girls. Good job. Oh no. A big dinosaur burst into the room. He glared at the ice cream and he took out a spoon. He put on a bib. He pulled up a chair. What did Joe say? It is awesome to share. And then everyone sang, sing with me, love my doggy ice cream, love my doggy ice cream. Arrgh! Oh no, a huge dinosaur smashed into that room. She glared at the ice cream she took out a Boom. She put on a bib. She pulled up a chair. What did Joe say? It is awesome to share. And everybody sang, Love my doggy ice cream. Love my doggy ice cream. Arrgh! was empty. The ice cream was through. So the dinosaurs glared at you know who. What can Joe do? He turned over the tub. He made it a drum. Groovy Joe beat out a rum a tum tum. The dinosaurs laughed. They rose from their chair. They started to dance. They jumped in the air. And then what did they say? That's it's awesome to share. And everyone sang together, love my doggy ice cream. Sing with me, love my doggy ice cream. Thank you, boys and girls, for being such good listeners and sharing that story with us. Thank you. Okay, boys and girls, it's time to say goodbye. So Mrs. Sue and Timmy the Turtle are here to say goodbye to you, and please stay safe. See you soon. Here we go. Sing with me. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everyone. It's fun to be with you. Have a good day.